Okay, we're going in. Looks like the house is totally tile. There's the living room space. And the dining room under that light. And then over here is the master bedroom. So we'll go there first. Okay, the master bedroom. The windows all look good. There's the bathroom. And the walk-in closet. It's got a really small sliding glass door going out to the back porch. I'd recommend changing that out to a French door or something because the opening is pretty small. And then right out here we've got like some kind of a bar built in. And here's what the kitchen looks like. Pretty nice. The store straight ahead is going out to the garage and I happen to have that open. The appliances look new. Yep, they are. Got a kind of a smaller size, like an apartment size dishwasher that is also new. Stainless steel on, si in, on the inside. A disposal. Doesn't look like it's been leaking down there. And the pantry. Little doggy door going out to the garage. It's got a single car garage. And then there's a step down, or a step up, and then this is where the front of the garage would be where your washer and dryer hookup is, the water heater. And then they've got mirrors all along this one wall. And I'm guessing this is 10 feet going across here. Here's the breaker box. OK, 
Okay, so the other bedrooms are on this side of the house. There's a screen that looks like it's busted out of this one. And the trim looks like it's going to need like a quarter round to finish it off because you can see up underneath the trim. They probably just used the trim that was here before when there was carpet and you never saw that gap. That's in both bedrooms. And then it's got a normal closet. Ceiling fan is missing. No, nope, it's just missing a globe. And the side back. Got a really nice shower door on it. It's got a linen closet. And the third bedroom. There you have it.